Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cowboy Temporal, and I mean, things have been going great. Uh, a little too great. I don't know. Like, there was, it's just my experience with this game in the early game and now is, I mean, I'm not complaining, but it's, it's night and day. But this place is called Momentum. That scares me. What is going on here? Oh, lots of time travel. Oh, I cannot actually go up there. I can stop time. Time machine is right here. Oh, this... Oh, I... What? What are we doing? Uh, I guess I can fit in there. And I guess I'm gonna want to freeze time to do something over there, maybe? My goal is to get up there. My goal is to find whatever it is that activates that door. Uh, yeah, I have like zero text. No one is talking at length. All right, that's gonna be enough to get me up there. I'm gonna try and push that down there. And then I can stand here. And another me can- oh, but then... No, 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 okay! We let it drop, we stop time! And, uh, and we're gonna put it over the fuse, okay. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna restart them. Alright. Because I, I think I'm gonna end up being in the way more than anything. So I'm gonna time travel to... Uh, well, you know what? Actually, now that I think about it... I can just do this. And, like, I can pause myself... I can pause time and use myself as a platform to get up there. Then once I'm up there, I'm going to just push it down the thing. Okay, okay, let's just do this one step at a time. So, cool bean, jelly bean. Let's just go to the very as far to the start as I can. So here I am, just sitting around. I'm gonna wait until I start hovering. You didn't. You didn't. You did you, you, you... Ah, annoying. Alright. At 15. Okay. Sink. Take a take a take a take a take Cool. Yeah, I don't know why you didn't go into the machine there. I guess I didn't hold enough? I feel like yesterday I commented how it just kinda needs a little press. But you still need a little bit more of a press. Alright, at 15. Boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool, cool, cool. And I even pushed you around there, thus ensuring that we have ourselves uh, uh, fallen time. Alright, I want to return back to this. You actually give a lot of time for um, that, which is, I think, a little bit strange. Okay, so, right. So now what I'm going to do is at 40, I'm going to start to do that. Wow! Beautiful work, son! And I'm going to teleport at, I don't know, like around here? Hey, buddy. Hey, self. Hey, you managed to go in. So at 40, right? Well, once again, I just go in here. I see that I'm gonna scoot on over. Beautiful. I can put that over that, and that's gonna start that. And, uh, I think, I don't know, like, what am I going to do after this? Because I feel like it's meaningful that there's all of, you know, I don't know, I can still time travel. It's probably to be able to go back up, I'm going to assume. Caution. Yeah, like, I'm just kind of still... Okay, you know what? Oh, 
Okay, well, what... I think I needed to do that. Yeah, because it blocked the way, but, like, you saw it, right? Like, my time was just bad. Uh, I have to start over. I have to start over. My timing was just bad with, with accessing time zones. Time stop. Ah, oh, dude, really? Cool. Yeah, there's no... So I think I need to time travel. But there I was in the way. Because I think I need to go... Go wait there after the explosion. Oh, there's a down. And there's a button I need to press. I didn't realize it was a down. But yeah, like, what I need to do is, uh, time travel, and my f fourth one is going to get here, push this into that switch, which is gonna open the door? Um... But then I'm not sure how I'm gonna go out. I'm gonna make sure I, I need to at least leave one guy here to serve as a platform again. I think all that's gonna work. This is a lot. We're getting back into fiddly stuff a little bit. But I think it's gonna work. I don't know. There you're just in the way. Like, I, I regret this, actually. I might have just made things harder by staying there. Oh, I messed up, and I, I, I went back on a run. <laughs> yep! Cool. Uh, that's f I can't push it down, can I? See, like, does it need to be that precise? Like, I know what I need to do. I'm very annoyed. Because, like, you press down and then there is a moment of time before it actually freezes. Like, it's not instantaneous. So, it makes timing this just, like, unnecessarily difficult. Cause my goal is to have someone in there. Well, time to find out. Ooh, okay. I think the timing there was fine. Dude, how? How is that not good enough? How can I not push this? Really? Is it just that much to... Okay, I'm gonna keep pushing, keep pushing. Hopefully... That's ridiculous. And then, assuming that opens up the door... But... Instead... What if I had ran through the explosions... I could have lodged myself underneath... I don't see how that would have helped anyone. Alright, we're back to like actual like difficult puzzles here. Okay, I have an idea that could work, but like I feel like I need to keep the jar at its- Oh, this is hard. Oh my god, I hate you so- See, so we can have it like up there, because that's gonna t buy me more time. Whoops. Oh, I can just push it up too. True, I had forgotten about that. Okay, that lets me... ...go here. 
Is that useful? I think it's at the exact right height for another one of me to go in here and push it down. Now the question is, do I have enough time to do everything else I need to do? I don't know yet. I think I'm just gonna stay it on precision the whole thing here. It just kind of feels better. Oh wait, I can go in here ahead of time. I can stop myself because I forgot that too. I can do that thus And I'm gonna stay here until I just do that. Do a lapse until uh, even one. I don't know if that's enough. I'm gonna say 130. I can't push it up. Well, let's see what happens. Okay, do I still have time? Go underneath it. Yes, I do actually. That's interesting. So I have more time to do this than I keep thinking than I do. I mean, I'm hoping that the cube can fit here. Like, I'm hoping that it's cut just at the right height. I guess I don't know that yet. I have time to do it. I just don't see why why else this would be done this way otherwise. Alright, like 30 should be good. 30 is when I pushed a jar after all. Alright, I killed someone. Okay, but if I keep pushing here, if I keep pushing when you leave, this is stupid. Like, so that's not it then, is what you're saying. But it seems like it's made for that. I don't get it. I don't get it. Uh... I don't know if this is a switch that you just like that you if you I don't know if you need to hold that switch or just press it once. Man, I thought I had it though, but it's not. So you know, we're back in that situation where I need to explore my options, but, uh, I need to do all the fiddly bits every time to get a chance at it. So what if I just stayed here? You need to jump. So that's not gonna work. You want to charge imminent. Well, I should still experiment, but... Yes, I can do that. If I had stop time... I wonder. Because if I had stop time, I could have gone here, pushed him here, then returned somewhere else. Could, like, I have prepared that motion. just go on the switch or would the block have stopped me from even like pretending to press up and to the side uh -uh. like would that have been enough okay well, I'm gonna try again so at 50 and Okay, let's try that. 
Or now I'm actually at the height where that can be pushed, probably. No. So, like, this is not gonna be the winning run. Because I don't have a way out. This is where I'm checking to see if, like, I can actually, like, do my ideas. So, the glass shattering means that I am in position. No, no, I wanted to... Ah, I forgot. I forgot, and I ruined everything. Cool. I love it. I love just forgetting things. Ah! This game, I'm just... <sighs> You've got to be kidding me. plan is that I push you here and that with my master puppeteering you're you're, you're just gonna fly just a little bit high and then go on the thing Hey, okay, it worked. Oh shoot. I'm, le I'm giving myself up to 30, so I got plenty of time. I hope. Okay. Okay, I did it! Oh boy. Yeah, and I got like an abandoned man over there and there, but that's fine. Heads up! You did not say anything all level, buddy! Oh, gamma build up. Yeah, it's called a gamma chamber. There is gonna be gamma there. That's accurate. Watch out for that gamma! Hoi! Okay! Uh, 44, 44 minutes and a half. We're back to the, um... We are back to the complete nonsense of this game. So yeah, I landed there, then another me just kind of showed up. That was pretty rad. Uh, then another me just kind of showed up too. I just keep showing up. Uh, wait, how do you... Well, you're gonna time travel. You know, while everything is going around up there. So you do that. You appear... You... 
You disappear and appear instantly, which is really funny. And then another me shows up and just kind of crawls around. Whoa, there's another me again! I just keep showing up! <laughs> it's so strange. It is uh, absolutely ludicrous. And then it's like, oh, hey. Ah, uh, well, you know what? I'm just gonna go in this orb here and teleport up there while you're hopping up and down for some reason. Beautiful work. And what I wonder, like, it's gonna create a paradox, right? Because, like, I abandoned a guy on the Switch. He's never gonna be able to break out of there. Like, he's that's just his home. Until he fades away. I am extremely cruel to myself. That is just accurate. I don't know how you- Oh, because I just walked on the thing. I did not actually fly. That's- Okay, that's why that keeps happening. Because, yeah, I just walk on the- On the screen normally. And that's why I have two paradoxes. Because of that. I expected one. I ended up with two. Ah! Re breach! We're breaching! Next time we're breaching, we can see our little little bot boy get zapped by a laser. So maybe another boss thing. Cool, great, fantastic. Hey, look, man, level call momentum. I w Turns out it wasn't hard because of the momentum. But it ended up being challenging anyways.